We like to say the rug is something that's often overlooked, but it's so important because it can pull the entire room together. The right rug will connect all of your furniture pieces, all of your accessory pieces. It will make the room feel softer and more cozy and inviting, and obviously we're really passionate about it. In a sitting area or any area with upholstery, the rule of thumb is you really want the legs of the furniture at least to touch the rug because again, that rug is a connecting factor. The rug placement is just underneath the front legs of each piece. Even including the chaise here, you can see it's not all the way underneath. And this is just one of the examples we have to show you and give you inspiration at Furniture Land South of how best to set up your living space. There's a rule of thumb for a queen bed, you use an eight by 10 at least. For a king bed, you use a nine by 12 at least. And there's a certain way that we always recommend that you lay your rug, and I'll show you that placement because we think it's really important. So here's a good example of a bedroom group like we talked about before. Here on the platform, you can see how we've set this up with a queen bed, two nightstands, dresser on the side. And this is how we always suggest you run the rug. You wanna run the length of the rug with actually the width of your headboard and your two nightstands. It gives a good balancing effect. And you can see here where we put it a little more than halfway up underneath the bed, but not all the way to the nightstands, and it really unifies everything in the room. Dining room, there is, we call it the hard and fast rule. You really want at least 24 inches all the way around for your chairs to pull in and out. So for example, if your table is 72 inches, 76 inches long, you'll need at least an eight by 10 or an eight by 11 to accommodate all of the chairs. We literally have something to offer for every space, every person, and every budget. 